drivers take a step behind the line. We're going to start in three, two, one, crescendo. As we start the penultimate match, I am really thrilled to be able to use her penultimate. Both teams work to score well. But then not a lot happens. At the end of the autonomous time, blue has 21 points and red has 14. For the Red Alliance, Team 8839, Shoshone Robotics immediately works to put a note into the amp, while Team Taters plays a long-range note from the back of the orchestra pit. Team 3288, the Punchers, have been designated to play defense for the Red Alliance. They've moved down to the Blue Alliance end to try to throw the Blue Alliance members off their game. The Alchemists line up and are, are a bit thrown off. On the Red Alliance end, Team Taters zings another note in. While Shoshone Robotics continues to put notes into the amp. Manhattan Project. Their specialty seems to be putting notes into their amp. They're able to add them in. We have a collision with the Manhattan Project and Team Taters as they're both zooming back and forth across the field. Shoshone Robotics comes down, tunes up, and adds their note at the same time as Team Taters does for a major chord. a very tight match. Both teams are scoring a lot. With 30 seconds left in the match, it is virtually even. Team 3288, the punchers, kind of staying down in the blue area. Shoshone Robotics has started their climb onto stage, while Team Taters takes one final match and putting more notes into the speaker. The blue, blue speaker was amplified. So as time runs out, the score so shows dead even. And it's a red alliance victory by two points. Two points on this, the four to two points on the stage made that difference. Each member of the Red Alliance will.